And this speaks to actually a criminological phenomena which I want to walk you through. And I'm going to um, try and inject a little bit of humor into this because it could otherwise be rather depressing. I like to think of this theoretical perspective as like the Yoda theory of why people commit crime. You'll be familiar perhaps from the Star Wars movies that Yoda has this very famous quote where he says, fear is the path to the dark side. Fear leads to anger, anger leads to hate, hate leads to suffering. And that's why Anakin becomes Darth Vader, right? So let's take Yoda's words and just sort of change them around a little bit. Instead of fear, we're going to use a word frustration. Frustration is the path to the dark side. Frustration leads to anger, anger leads to hate, hate leads to suffering. When people are frustrated and they don't feel like they have other mechanisms to sort of release the valve and get that frustration out, it can lead to serious consequences. And this is actually a take on Robert Agnew's strain theory, which was published in 1991, general strain theory, which is essentially this, where people feel like their ability to achieve valued goals in society has been blocked for some reason, where they've been presented with noxious stimuli. And what that means is bad stuff. When they've been presented with bad stuff, or when the good stuff has been taken away, the death of a loved one, the loss of a job, a divorce, and they don't have appropriate coping mechanisms to deal with that, that frustration that comes through can channel itself into criminal behavior and violent behavior.